NFL owner in full panic after what Packers star said he's doing at next game that'll destroy team. The anti-American epidemic within the National Football League has reached pandemic proportions as the commissioner sits back and allows the problem to persist while it gets worse each day. If the league doesn't get ahead of the problem immediately and change the course the season is going, it could be the end of the NFL as we know it. However, the star player for the Green Bay Packers wants to ensure that happens with what he announced he'll be doing at the next game that could officially destroy his entire team. The point with the national anthem protests have been made and now it's time for it to stop, but that doesn't seem like it will happen anytime soon. The competition level within the sport has transferred from the actual game to who can make a bigger, more disgusting statement than the last athlete. It appears that Packers Aaron Rodgers wants the title in a sudden surprising move. Of all the teams in the NFL, the Packers was among those who have gone against the grain and not wasted airtime and energy protesting. This was in large part due to coach Mike McCarthy's unique approach to combating this issue on his field. From the start of the preseason when the protests began, McCarthy preempted the problem on his team by educating his players on why we stand for the anthem since ignorance is why most of the idiotic athletes are sitting or kneeling on the sidelines. He's put the knowledge of the real history of this nation on the field to stop players from making fools of themselves with protests. However, his quarterback didn't listen to this lesson, or one of the team owners' shocking ultimatum yesterday. Rodgers just proved that players don't care about anything other than the attention they get. Just hours after one of his team's shareholders announced that he's ready to call it quits if the protests across the NFL persist because he's livid about what it's done to the league. The quarterback must have taken that as a challenge, spitting on this man's massive investment and followed up the announcement with one of his own. National Football League, NFL Star Aaron Rodgers says that fans should lock arms during his next game in a show of solidarity with players. This is about equality, he told Packers News Tuesday. This is about unity and love and growing together as a society, and starting a conversation around something that may be a little bit uncomfortable for people. Who it's really uncomfortable for is the shareholder of his team who is rightfully fed up with these constant antics that distract from the sport. It's time to separate athletics and politics and let people enjoy this pastime again. Now he's probably panicking about the loss of revenue his franchise will likely face like the others teams have experience who brought protests on the field. Rogers' misguided move to lock arms in the name of equality and push this agenda could destroy his team if the shareholder sticks to his threat of bailing out of the business and if fans start boycotting too. This seems to have already begun based on the reactions. The quarterback explained more about why he decided to suddenly do this protest now. But we've got to come together and talk about these things and grow as a community, as a connected group of individuals in our society, and we're going to continue to show love and unity, the Green Bay Packers quarterback added, according to Circa. And this week we're going to ask the fans to join in as well and come together and show people that we can be connected and we can grow together. The furious shareholder unloaded his ultimatum to the players in a phone conversation with the news outlet The Daily Caller, as we reported yesterday. He didn't hold back when he expressed how upset he is with protesting and it's a sentiment that most Americans share at this point in the protests, more than what Rogers had to say. I am FG livid right now. I see this ST and I lose my mind. It needs to end immediately. The owner shouted over the phone the phone with the new source on Monday night. I'll give up football completely and find something else to do with my time if this continues, he added. This horse ST must end. These players are so out of touch. They disrespect our flag and then wonder why Trump won. It's a no-brainer. This is so disrespectful. People will run to college football over the NFL in droves if these protests continue. The owner ended the conversation in saying, Regardless of how much money he has in his team, he's willing to relinquish control over his massive investment because he's so fed up, and who can blame him? Despite it being disrespectful, it's nauseating to see. People are tired of it, including the guy who has a ton of money invested in it. The players are too arrogant to see it or care because they are loving all the attention they're getting for it, getting for it.